Hi, I'm Angie, and I'd like to welcome you to National Indoor RV Centers, where we specialize in the sale, service, storage, and detailing of only high-end new and used coaches. So basically, we do it all. Come take a tour with me of one of the hundreds of coaches we currently have in our inventory. I've been looking forward to doing this video walk around since Integra's ribbon cutting for its new factory in Middlebury. So today I finally get to show you the all new 2016 Anthem. As you know, Integra is the quietest riding, best handling coach on the market today, period. One of the things that I love that they did with their new in caps is that they've boldly written Integra across the front. You know what kind of coach is coming down the road. It's backlit, it looks great. Also, the sea lighting is very bold. Um, Integra only uses the best products. So they use Sickens paint and three coats of clear. Along with that, they use a 3M protective film across the whole front cap. Notice the beautiful chrome mirrors. These are heated and internally controlled. They also have a new feature in them this year, which is a side view camera. So it sits up higher and gives you a great view of the entire length of your coach. So you have no more blind spots. The Anthem has larger tires than most of the coaches in its class. The front tires are Michelin 315s and the back tires are Michelin 295s. This allows for greater weight capacity and carrying capacity. Here we have the dual fuel 150 gallon tank. So you can fuel this from either side of the coach. So you can literally fill this coach up faster than I can fill up my car. Now I want you to notice something as I walk towards this security light. It's motion censored, so as I walk towards it, it's going to come on. Another nice security feature that Integra has put into their coaches. So I want to go over the basement of the Anthem. Here we have the freezer. This is great for your tailgating, just for cold drinks, or if you're out in the Pacific Northwest and you want to bring back fish to your family, great place to store it. Uh, another great feature about Integra's basement is that they are 30 inches tall, fully carpeted, heated, and LED lit. Here's your pass-through tray, so you can access this from either side of the coach. All right, something I want you to pay particular attention to is this X bracing that's in the coach. So Integra does X bracing from the front to the rear of the coach. It's vertical and horizontal. So what that does is it uh, takes away the torquing, flexing um, of the coach. So in short, it makes the independent front suspension do the work, not the chassis. It also eliminates popping of your windshield or tiles when you're going over rough surfaces. It's a great feature. The Anthem comes with a frameless, dual pane, tinted windows throughout the coach. I really want you to pay attention to the beautiful awnings. These Gerard awnings are integrated into the front and end caps, giving this coach a much more bus-like profile. If you'll notice, they are the industry's first Gerard Vision dual-pitched awnings. The greater pitch gives you optimal shade. And you'll also notice that they are LED lit along the whole edge of the awning. So when you come into a campground at night and you see your coach sitting there and it's all lit up, it looks like the boss. Anyway, they are beautiful and they are great for shade with this extra pitch on them. As we move on, we're gonna go to our first of four TVs. This is a Samsung 40 inch TV. It has the JBL soundbar, which has the AM FM radio. Also, it will stream with your Bluetooth device. So. Hold on to me as we go. It also has the tilt and swivel arm. So you can adjust that to face your guests. Anyway, it just makes for a great environment for a tailgate party for you and your wife to be sitting out, hanging out underneath the awning in the shade. It's just a great entertainment area. Here in the rear of the coach, we have this small little door that gives you easy access to your DEF tank, or you can access it from the larger bay door. So you have your DEF tank, your house, your chassis batteries, 
and this is my favorite option that you're gonna love. Have you ever wrestled with the engine cover, trying to get that off, thrown out your back? Well, you're not gonna have any more of that. So all you have to do is press this little button here, and voila! Before we go into the engine compartment, I want to make sure you notice the beautiful end cap on the Integra. So they've got the Integra name, backlit, and bold up top, and the big C lighting. This coach looks amazing. Now, Integra does a great job. They're one of the only, I think they are the only manufacturer that insulates their end cap. So why is that a big deal? It makes it significantly easier to heat and significantly easier to cool the coach. So think about what's right behind on the other side of the end cap. It's either going to be your master bedroom or your master bathroom. Places that you both want to maintain either cool or hot. So it's a great, back, uh, great feature. The Anthem sits on the Spartan Mountain Master chassis. It has the Cummins ISL 450 horsepower turbocharged diesel engine with a six-speed Allison transmission and it will tow 15,000 pounds. So what does that mean? It means that you can tow your 5,200 pound Jeep Grand Cherokee or your 7,500 uh, pound four wheel drive Suburban, or you can stick them both together in a double stacker trailer and you're not gonna feel a thing. Another great feature is it has the engine block heater right here. So on those cold mornings, you just plug that in and you're not gonna worry about your coach starting up for you. Also notice that the engine is very easy to get to. Why is that? Because it has a side radiator. So that's a big deal because it's going to be easier for any kind of maintenance on your engine and it's going to cost less because they don't have to go around um, the radiator to get to the engine. Here we have our side radiator that I just mentioned and then we're moving on to our wet service bay. Integra has totally changed this this year and it's really nice. First of all, you'll see that there is rope lighting that totally illuminates the whole bay. And they've added nice labels to everything so you can easily see where everything is. Tegra is big on redundancy. So here we have the C-Level 2 tank monitor system. We have that here along with inside the coach. We also have a spot for your soap or your rubber gloves, paper towels. We have the automatic water reel. And over here we have the easy accessible water filter. And then some of you may be wondering what this little tool is. You do need it. That's what you use to break the seal on your water filter to change that. And they've added a hook, so it has a place to stay. My favorite thing that they've added back here is they've gotten rid of the wussy shower hose, shower head. So now you have a coil um, cord and a high pressure sprayer. And that's not all the great features. So now you can easily remove your utility panel. And that gives you access to your Thetford macerator. Some of you may be asking, what is a macerator? Basically, it's a garbage disposal for your black tank. So, um, like I said before, Integra is big on redundancy. What if something happens and your uh, macerator gets clogged up? You can bypass the system manually so you would just pull that level, level here and then attach your stinky slinky to the underside of the coach. So you, you're not gonna run into a problem there. Also, this gives you access so you can easily winterize your coach if needed. Here is your stinky slinky. This year, they've added a threaded, no, threaded nozzle so it fits securely or locks into the inlet for the drum station. Here we have the electrical reel for your 50 amp shore power cord, your aqua hot system, which provides the heat for your furnace and your on-demand hot waters. Also, we have, this is a huge feature. This is a surge guard RV power protection transfer switch. So you're probably wondering what that means. It's really important. If you're in a campground and the polarity is off, this will protect your electric system, electrical system from frying. Here's your pass-through tray that you can access from either side of the coach. They've given us a little more storage area here, and then our eight AGM house batteries that easily 
come out so they can be serviced. And a uh, place for our stinky slinky, which they have mislabeled as a sewer hose. But we'll let them call it whatever they want. And the other access to the fuel tank from the other side of the couch. All right, remember how I keep saying that Integra is big on redundancy? Well, this is the perfect example. Have you ever been in a campground and had your batteries die? You need to get your car back there so you can jump the chassis batteries, which are in the back of the coach, and you can't do that. So what's your option? You're gonna to have to have a mobile sur service call, which is super expensive. Well, Integra has literally thought of everything. They're really in it for the RVer. So you can jump the Anthem from the front of the coach right here or from the back of the coach. So they eliminate that problem for you. All right, now we're gonna talk about the generator. Before I start, you're gonna love this new feature. There is a powered slide out for the generator. So I'm just gonna run around the corner here and push the button. All right, here's the Cummins Onan 12,500 watt generator. Integra's probably gone a little bit overboard on this. You can literally be driving down the road, running all three AC units, your microwave, your oven, whatever, and you don't have to worry about tripping the breaker. And I'm talking about this breaker right here. So if you were to trip it, you've got to pull your coach over to the side of the road, open up your generator, and flip that breaker. So really, Integra's done you a great favor because you don't have to worry about tripping this breaker. All right, before we head inside, I just wanted to tell you a few more things. First of all, we're gonna be going into the 42 RBQ. 42 stands for the length of the coach, so it's 42 feet long, and RBQ stands for rear bath quad slide. Just a little helpful hint as you're out there shopping for your next coach. Also, something you'll love about the Anthem is that we have the key fob for the door locks. Lock it there simply, unlock, and for the cargo area. So I can lock that and unlock it at a touch of a button, which is really handy. Or you can just use the keyless pad here, set your code, and you can get in without a key. Okay, as we head inside, I wanna tell you some of my favorite things. My first favorite thing is that the main power switch is right here. So you don't have to walk up into the coach and try to fumble around in, cap in cabinets and find that switch. It's right here as you walk in the door. My second favorite thing is that there's a master light switch. So one touch, you can light your whole coach. Also, you can light the outside, your awnings, your porch light, and your motion lights. All right here before you even step in your coach. Now, one more um, button that you will really appreciate is the step power button. So what does this mean? When I go in and out of my coach, the, slide, the steps go in and out with me. But once I've you know, set up my camp and I'm parked, I don't want my steps to keep going back and forth. It's gonna ruin my motor. So you just put, push this button here. When I shut the door this time, the steps are gonna stay out. All right, here I am in the comfy captain's chair, ready to go. These are really nice. They're made by Flex Steel. You have the easy finger control here to adjust your arm rests, and they're just really nice, comfy seats. All right, onto our control panel here to the left. Uh, we have our main power switch here. So I've talked about Integra and their tendency to be redundant. This is another example of that. We have the main power switch when we come into the coach and a main power switch here for the driver. So he can park, hit the power switch, and exit the coach. We also have our dock lights. So if you're going into a Walmart at night, you wanna be able to see the curb, or if you're trying to pull into a campground at night, you wanna see what's around you. So you hit those dock lights, it will illuminate the area around the bottom of the coach. We also have our two-stage Jake, Jake brake and we have our pedal control. So you simply push that and adjust the pedals to each individual driver. Now pay attention to this little button with the arrows on it. I'm gonna tell you about that in just a second. Here we have controls for our front day shades, heated mirror controls, our lights here, our equalizer system, which is your auto leveling jacks. 
Then you simply pull this level here and you can adjust your steering wheel. Okay, now I want to talk just a little bit about the steering wheel. It has nice hand controls, so your cur courtesy lights, cruise control, your wipers. It also has an added bonus. Down here we have little pedal controls that will control your radio. So everything is right at your fingertips when you're driving. Now we have the Spartan Messaging Center. So this is a great little tool to give you information about your coach and about your trip while you're driving. It's not super convenient though because you have to reach through your steering column to get the information. Well, Integra has fixed that. So this little button I told you about earlier, you just simply push that button and it will scroll through the information you want to find. So again, right at your fingertips, very easy, safe for the driver. Here's our six-speed Allison transmission. And you're probably wondering what kind of gas mileage this coach gets. We've talked to some of our customers with Anthems, and you can expect to get 8.5 to 9.5 gallons per, per mile with the coach fully loaded and a tow vehicle. I love how Integra has integrated all of their electronic components to work together. For example, with this screen here, it controls all these functions. But if we want to go ahead and turn it to our Rand McNally nav system, I can throw it up on this screen and have it show on our second TV here or on any TV throughout the coach or the outside if I want it to. Now we're watching right here is the, we're looking at the rear view camera. If we want to see the side cameras, I simply click the turn signal and we can see down the entire length of the coach. So we'll have no blind spots. We also have our DC charger here, USB, our gin start, and we have our 110 volt outlet right here. All right, here I am in the comfy co-captain's chair. A few things I want to point out to you. First of all, Integra has added the lighted step well area. And I have a little button right here at my fingertips so I can put the step slide out. It's handy, it's right next to me. I don't have to reach across to the dash. Also, I want you to notice the nice handlebars here that they're all wood and really nice to help you as you get in and out of the coach. Over here on the right hand panel, I have my day and night shake controls, my step control. I also have a 12 volt charging area and a 110 volt uh, outlet. Okay, let's talk about all the functions that take place in this little cabinet here. First of all, we have the WineGuard satellite system. This is the booster for your antenna. We have the intra door awning extend and retract button. Here is the control for your main Girard awnings. There's also a shake sensor on those awnings as well. This is your WineGuard in motion satellite control. So you can actually uh, watch TV as you're driving down the road. Here is your power control system. So this is really a system to protect your coach. It's gonna tell you what amp you're hooked up to. If you're hooked up to 30 amp or your gen and you don't have enough power to run all your systems, it's gonna start shedding the load. So initially it will shed your water heater, then your rear AC, then your front AC, and then your midship AC. This is your command 30. Auto gen start, this is a huge deal because you, you don't have to worry about leaving your coach and coming back to dead batteries or a hot coach. If it sees that your uh, batteries are getting low, it will automatically start and start to charge them. Also, if you preset it to work with your AC, if your coach starts to get too hot, it will automatically come on and cool your AC. And it will turn off once it's charged your batteries. Here are your two inverters, your 2800 watt inverter and your 2000 watt inverter. Basically, these allow you to enjoy the comforts of your coach without being on your generator or your shore power. All right, over to this cabinet. Here we have our power control center for our generator 
and our sure power and we have the control center for our two inverters. As you'll notice, these are all very easy to get to and nicely labeled. So Integra just again makes it very easy to use your coach. Another great feature that you're gonna love in the 2016 Anthem is that you can control the nightshades in the living room separate from the nightshades in the bedroom. I just finished speaking with a customer who said he likes to get up before his wife and if he wants to raise all the nightshades, it raises the bedroom shades as well. So with this little button here, you can simply raise the nightshades throughout the living room without affecting the shades in the master bedroom. You can also lower the shades for the whole front of the coach by the push of a button. So you have a lot of options with your day and night shades with this multiplex lighting system. We have the beautiful flex steel sofas. We have a hide a bed in this sofa here. I've extended the footrest on both the co-captain and captain's chair, so that basically gives you two nice recliners, plus you get a third here. So sit back, flip the lever, and there you have your third reclining seat. So this living room comfortably seats seven adults. Also notice the beautiful ceiling treatments. Uh, Integra has added those this year, enhanced them, and they look beautiful. I get asked all the time, what is the best way to heat your coach? So you have three options in this coach. First of all, you can use your heat pumps, which work through your AC unit, until it reaches 40 degrees. Once you go below 40 degrees, you need to use your furnace, which works through your aqua hot system. Then in this coach, you have a third option. It's your electric fireplace. This is a great little option. It is remote controlled, you simply turn it on. It is thermostat controlled as well, so you can decide how much heat you want it to put out, and you can select which type of flame. So you simply scroll through, one, two, three, four, and five, pick your favorite flame. So it's really nice, and it's probably the cheapest way to heat your coach if you're plugged in. So it's just pennies to heat it. Also another great feature that comes standard on this coach is the heated floors. As you're looking at these heated floors, note how beautiful the hand laid tile is. So they just do a great job. We also have this beautiful dinette that's really comfy. You can squeeze in. It does extend slightly. Great little eating area. Oh, and lots of storage. So we have this huge storage door there. Another one here underneath your booth. Moving on into the kitchen, one of my favorite spots, we have the nice size, residential size refrigerator. We also have a pantry here that you can access from this side and this one from that side. You can extend your countertops by simply pulling out this and you still have great and in your drawers here. Also notice the beautiful accent lighting they've added to the edge of all the solid surface countertops. I think it's a big wow factor and you can turn that light on or off but either way it looks great. We have the double stainless steel sink and one of the features that I love is that you have the pull out garbage can. So you can store your garbage here, you don't have to find a place for it in your coach and contributing to the quietest ride, they have a slot here for your sink covers. So you can simply have them here. When you need that, when you're, when you're using your sink, you can put them down here. And they're not gonna rattle. This has an extra filtration system here for your drinking water. Also notice the beautiful cabinetry. It's nice and solid, and they have pull-out trays. So everything is very easy to get to. We have the dishwasher, the double burner induction stove top, and the convection microwave oven. Before we leave this area, I want to make sure I give a lot of attention here to our Samsung 50 inch 4K ultra high def smart TV with the Bose sound system that goes throughout the coach. 
So this is like the newest thing out there, totally great. One of my favorite features in this coach is just a little one, but as a mom, you guys will appreciate this as well, is the little dustpan. So you sweep all your debris over into here, hit that, and it sucks all the debris out of the coach. We also have our central bag here, so you can reach the entire coach. And there is an attachment for the central bag in the basement compartment as well, which is unique to Integra. Here we have our washer and dryer that the light automatically comes on when I open the doors. Stackable, and they are Whirlpool brand. And I just wanna point out again that your refrigerator, your kitchen, your washer and dryer and your half bath are fully accessible when your slides are in and you're going down the road. All right, onto our half bath. This is nice and roomy in here. We have behind this panel, basically our whole fuse box. We have the controls for the aqua hot. Again, redundancy. Here is our second sea level two tank monitor system. Our controls for our AC units and then all of our fuses. They are easily labeled over here and they're lit. So when this light is green, it's working. If it goes red, I know that's the fuse that has gone out. So again, they've made it super easy to use. Great space for your to toiletries. Nice amount of counter space as well. Okay, so here we are in the elegant master bedroom. I think they've done a great job. They do all the extras, beautiful bedding. It's satin lined on the underside of the bed. We have the great um, Tempur-Pedic mattress. So these are really nice because they decrease the motion when you're sleeping. So if your spouse gets up and goes to the bathroom, you're not gonna feel it on your side of the bed. It's really nice and they're super comfy. Also, you have all your controls up here above the bed. You can turn these on and off with your finger and you can lock and unlock the door to your coach. So if you've got kids coming in or you have a guest that's coming in, you're in bed, you can lock the coach safely and then unlock it when they get to your coach. Also, you can control your shades and your lights here. And the control for your ceiling fan is over in the corner there. I'll show you that in a minute. Another nice feature is that you have 110 outlets on both nightstands. So you have a nice countertop here for a nightstand on each side of the master bed with an outlet so you can charge all your devices. Another great feature are the locking doors. So you have air locks. When the coach goes into drive, air pressure sucks those doors in tight so they don't rattle. Again, this contributes to the quietest riding, best handling coach on the market today, period. Okay. Then we have our fourth TV, Samsung TV, along with the Bose system. We have our safe in the back here. And just a ton of storage space, drawers, again, the nice lighted countertops. Before we head into the master bathroom, I want to show you the ceiling fan button. So it's right here. You have a high and a low. So that's very easy to function while you're laying in bed. Also another feature, just stay here, but I'm gonna come into the bathroom, I'm gonna hit the lights for the bedroom. I'm gonna push in the lights and just hold my finger there. And it acts as a dimmer. So you can totally set the mood for your bedroom or any part of your coach by dimming, you can dim the lights. All right, here we are in the master bathroom. First of all, notice the beautiful, hard, um, solid surface countertops, again with the lighting and the stainless steel faucets. We have tons of storage in here, above and below. We have the Tecma toilet that is just push button to flush. We also have the Fantastic Fan. We have one here in the master bath and we have one midship in the half bath. You can set these so that they'll come, they'll open up and air out the coach when it's not in use. Keeps it from getting too hot in here. Also, they can be open during adverse weather outside and rain will not get inside the coach. Moving on to the master closet. It's cedar lined. 
nice and deep so you can hang all your clothes, fold your clothes, you have little slots for shoes there. And Integra always does a nice job of giving you extra mats for your coach. So it's just nice to have those in case you need them. We also have a little linen closet back here and our huge, gorgeous shower. Step in here, plenty of space, and you have the magnetic strip that runs along the doors. So when you close that, you real, really seal it off so no water is going to get out. I hope that you've enjoyed this tour of the 2016 Anthem. If you want to see this coach or any other coaches in our inventory, you can visit us at any of our locations or on the web at nirbc.com. If you remember nothing else that I told you today, I want you to remember this one thing. Integra is the only manufacturer with a two-year warranty. They stand behind their product. Here at National Indoor RV Centers, we believe that buying a coach should be a fun and exciting experience, not an intimidating experience. You shouldn't feel like you have to be an expert negotiator just because you don't know what you don't know. When you're ready to buy a coach, we'd love to have you visit one of our locations to experience our no-haggle, transparent, and open approach to sales, which will place you on the same side of the table with us. Partners through your entire RV and lifestyle, whether it be the sale, service, storage, or detailing of your coach.